Hey, what's going on guys? It's Chris Luck and once again, it's a snowy, beautiful day here in Kodiak. It's about 25 degrees, about 15 mile an hour winds, gust of like 20, 25. And I'd say a lot of people would not fly their drone on a day like today. However, if you live in Alaska or you're coming to Alaska, you're not gonna find many days where you can fly your drone if you go by those rules because this is considered a really nice day. So I just wanna break a lot of myths today about flying a drone in the snow, in the winter, under 32 degrees, they say they can't handle it. I've personally flown my drone in negative 20 degrees up in Fairbanks multiple times and I've had no issues. The only thing that happens is a limited battery life. Typically the battery life is around 20 minutes on a good day for the DJI Mavic 2 Pro. That's what I'll be using today. When it was negative 20, I got around 12 to 13 minutes of flight time of in comfort where I wasn't like gonna like crash my drone because I let it die too fast or something. So I got a comfortable 12 to 13 minutes on the, those days. You can see it's, it's kind of foggy. You can see the mountains in the background a little bit. So visibility is not too bad. I'm in a good spot to fly and uh, I'm gonna get some footage. This is the uh, Sultry parking lot here at American River in Kodiak. So I'm gonna get some footage for you guys and show you that you can fly your drone in these conditions. I'm just gonna clear a nice little spot. That way the blades don't hit any snow. That's the only problem around here. It's hard to take off. A lot of brush and stuff. Here we go. <clears throat> Testing out some new tires here, that's all. That was kind of fun. Yeah, I like to fly with the light on sometimes just so I can get better tracking with my eyes. No issues. Uh, you do get a warning that says uh, strong wind gusts be advised, but uh, no issues. It flew great, got some photos, took some video, and uh, yeah, had a good time. I just want you guys to know that flying your drone in the snow and just in more of extreme conditioning, you want to build up to a comfort level, but it is very rewarding and I definitely invite you to try it out. It's not for everyone. They are expensive. Um, so I see why people are a little cautious with it, but also have some fun, enjoy it. And uh, yeah, I want to see what else this winter day can bring. We only have like 
20 minutes of daylight left. So I don't think I'm going to make anything else happen, but we'll see. All right. I don't know. I was just actually looking for the drone in the air still, and it was in my hand. I don't. I might be tired. 